What's up guys, welcome to Supercars of London and a video I am so excited about filming. You joined myself and Seb Delaney Hello, here everyone. in Monaco. The last time we did this video, I challenged Sam to the most expensive selfie here in Monaco during the F1 weekend of 2015. However, it is the height of the summer and arguably one of the busiest weekends here in Monaco. Thanks to the holidays, there are so many tourists around. So I thought that I would challenge Seb again to the most expensive selfie. For those that haven't seen the most expensive selfie challenge, then here are some of the rules that make it a little bit more difficult than just running around with your phone and snapping as many pictures as possible. You cannot take pictures of yachts. So you can't take oh. a selfie with the yachts, you can't take any selfies with the marina because you'd win. Oops. You also can't take any selfies with buildings because here in Monaco there are some pretty impressive buildings around. So that leaves cars and people. So if you spot a celebrity that you think has got a high oh, okay. net worth, then you can take a selfie with them. Oh, if cool. Lewis Hamilton was walking around, take a selfie with him. The other rule is you are only permitted to take two selfies in the half an hour time slot that we have. So you have to take them wisely. You can't run around taking loads and loads of selfies. And then the you, one that's the most... So yeah, you, you exactly. Can you can only, take, only two. take two selfies. Oh, wow. Okay. So it is uh, basically you have to rationalise whether you think it is going to yeah. be worth it or not. And how long do we have? Half an hour. Three, two, one. Go! Ciao! <laughs> Bye! <laughs> Right, okay, so the reason why I have selected to turn right, this is literally so unplanned, I just basically told Seb there that I was turning right, I may have scuppered his entire strategy, but I'm going to put all of my eggs in one basket and head to the beach club. It is Friday in August in Monaco. The beach club will be full of Rolls Royces, Bentleys, potentially some supercars, and if I can get one or even two selfies around that car park, I feel like I'm guaranteed to win. Okay, so here's my technique. I am going to zoom the camera in first of all. Right, I am going to go straight up. So I'm assuming that Paul going that way is going to go to all the residential buildings and then maybe the beach club. Zoom back out again. Whereas I am going to go to all the hotels and casinos. That's my technique. So I'm going to head straight to the Fairmont. Also Cipriani Corner where there's a really expensive restaurant where hopefully there'll be cool cars. And then Casino Square will be my final, hopefully, jackpot place. So I have played this game before. Seb has not played this game before. And uh, the rules are a little bit stricter this time because we have limited time. I think when me and Sam played it, we had an hour and three selfies. Whereas this time, uh, we've only got half an hour and two selfies, so I don't know whether Seb will be able to pace himself or whether he'll use up his two selfies um, too quickly and then find something at some point and not be able to take a selfie of it. However, it is not really about seeing one particular car, unless it's like a Venino or something. It is about a combo. It is about capturing more than five, potentially 10 cars, all in one picture where you can add the value up. Banana Spect Bentley Mosan by itself, not gonna be good. It's not gonna make the cut. Arrived at the Fairmont Hotel. Please be good to me, Fairmont. You're usually pretty good. We've got, what do we have, a Huracan. Uh, ooh, an FF of 911 and a G-Wagon. Oh, that is not the best lineup I've ever seen here. Damn it. This <laughs> is why <laughs> We don't allow yachts. All right, Casino Square, what do we have? California. Oh, SA Aperta. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. F40. Oh, man, that is awesome. Let me see if there's anything else around here. There's another speciali. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna take 458 Speciali Aperta and F40 as a selfie. Up to the Hermitage we go. No sick cars around here. Hopefully I'll see something there. Ambulances, they're worth quite a lot, aren't they? <laughs> My thought process and strategy into this video could completely get shut down. The uh, valet drivers don't like cameras into the beach club and I've got a massive one that I can't hide usually we just put it in our pockets but I can't put this in the pocket we are in sight and there is already a Rolls Royce there and the guy standing there too <laughs> so this 
is where my selfies lie. Right, I'm in. I'm keeping my camera low in case I get spotted. I am just coming around the corner. Bentley Mulzan, they're worth a fair amount. RS3, anything else? Oh my god! Oh my sweet lordy lord! We got RS3, Bentley, Bentley, SV Roadster over there, and Zonda F Club Sport, and Morgan Aero Super Sports, I think. So this, this is looking pretty good. AMG 458. This is backfiring on me massively. Oh, yes. Guys, I've hit the jackpot, the Koenigsegg 11 here. This has got to be one of my selfies. But. If I do a selfie from here, look. Selfie number one has got the Koenigsegg, the G-Wagon, which is a Brabus by Turbo 850, and those cars up there. Okay, so I'm now walking back to the beach club. There's a pretty awesome Bentley coming up here, um, but all of the valet drivers always stare. Either way, I'm going to film and hopefully get away with it. Hey! <laughs> it wasn't even a valet driver. <laughs> it was someone that said hello to me, which is nice. Flipping nailed it. I feel very, very confident now. I've got the SV, Zonda, Morgan, and I got all of these Bentleys in the background with the G-Wagon. So I'm feeling pretty confident. That plus the F40 and uh, 458 Perta. Now it's time to head back to Paul and gloat. Rolls. Another Bentley over there. Another Bentley here, GLE. Two more Bentleys and Aston Martin. Aston Martin, how do I get all of these in one picture? I've taken my selfies. And now, I need to get back. Hey, now I need to get back to where we started. He is not here. Oh, there he is. There he <laughs> came is. out from a different place. How did it go? Oh, uh, it's so hot. It's very hot. It is very hot. Come and sit oh, down. I'm stopping my camera. Come and sit down. <sighs> How did it go for you? I think it went quite well. Yeah? Yeah. Feeling confident? I'm feeling quite confident. Well, let's get back to Seb's house and find out the results. And for the first time, you'll get to see my selfies and I'll get to see yours. I know, right? <laughs> Here we go. We have made it back. I've showered because literally I was turning into a puddle of water. So we have got our selfies here. We literally have not shown each other. I have not seen Seb's selfies. We haven't talked about it. I'm very strict with my rules. Um, so, who's going to go first? Do you want to see my selfie one? Your selfie one, then I'll show okay. you my selfie one. This is my selfie one. I've even got my camera in there, which is about what? £300. You got the one one. So I've got the one one. So you one. went down to the beach Yeah, but past the beach club, into the little private bit. That's so a good, that's through. a good get. And this is a Brabus G-Wagon by Turbo 850. My first one is this. Wait, is that so an F40? F40, F40 there. 458 oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Aperta. Aperta. Bentega, really nice spec Bentega. Is that the Saudi one? Saudi yeah. one. California. Cali and then S63. Ooh, ooh. Hold on, let me see. I didn't, you didn't even tell me there was an F40. We didn't even go and look for <laughs> it. <laughs> I know, there you go. Wow. So There's my other one. You didn't see anything on my original bed. A selfie oh my God. of the car park because there's one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven Bentleys. There's two Aston Martins there. There's about eight or nine. Wait, where's the SUVs. second Aston? Oh yeah, yeah. Literally, if you zoom in, you can see the DB9 and a Rapide. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> the Zonda was there. So, I was expecting it to be like part around no, the corner. No, no, no. Zonda F Club Sport Roadster. Full carbon. Full carbon. I've seen that a lot. Yeah. So this is going to be close. This is because the one to one is worth so much money. But so is the Zonda. Yeah, the Zonda's worth a lot as well. Right. I don't know which okay. one's worth more, the Zonda or the one to one. Well, let's find out. Here we go. So I've Ooh. tallied up. I've tallied up values, but I haven't actually looked because it's such a long list. Here we go. There's such a long list of all of the values that I can't see, like sort of who wins. These are kind of based on values that we've seen on the internet, our own personal knowledge, and yeah. So I've priced the one one at two point five mil. There's not much information out there. Yeah, there's none for sale. Though. Um, that sounds about right, though. And I've also valued the Zonda F Club Sport at two million. That was the only price that I could come up with. They may have changed. They may vary depending on where you're buying them. But I'm literally anyway, they're going both a lot of pounds. Money. I'm going on pounds. Okay. So my selfie number one, the Koenigsegg one one, Brabus G Wagon, and others, three point five million. Three point five million in seven cars. So then your selfie... That is strong to start. Your selfie one, which was with the F40. Yeah. I haven't even calculated the value. <laughs> 1 1.3, 1 1.6, 1.75, 1.8, 1... 1! That's not yeah, a good start. 1 point... 1 point... This is pounds. 1.75 million is selfie number one. That's disappointing. My selfie number two, which was seven Bentleys, two Astons and eight SUVs, like it, I took a photo of a car park, it was actually two million quid. Because <laughs> I had seven, so wait, that seven selfie Bentleys. was more than my F40 Bentley. Seven Bentleys is a million pound. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. My two selfies, 3.5 million and two million. Strong. Very your first strong. one is 1.75, but your second one did have a Zonda in it. Okay, so that's Zonda, big, and that's what SV I'm... Roadster at half a million quid. The Morgan we valued at 200 grand. This could be a game changer. If we have undervalued the Morgan, please let us know in the comment box below because I, I valued think that it's at 200, 200 grand. grand. Yeah. Plus all the other cars, 3.25. No! <laughs> no! So, based on our So you went by 250? I won by a quarter of a million quid. <laughs> that is crazy. How close is that? That is so close. In half an hour, only two selfies. I checked Seb's phone, no other pictures. He checked my phone, no other pictures. That is so that close. Is crazy. So like, oh, I'm so I disappointed. Win. You're so lucky you still have one one. That was your, that was a good call. Anyway, there's your phone back with a lovely thank list so of all much. of the cars that we've seen. You. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. It has been an absolute pleasure to do the most expensive selfie well, challenge fun. again. I cannot wait to do round three who will be my challenger? Let me know in the comment box below. Please give it a, a thumbs up if you've enjoyed this video and if you want to see more. And also leave a comment and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching, guys, and I will see you very soon. Cheers.